Hey, go on. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Hello, everybody. How are you today? Excellent. Ready. Ready to work. I think so. I am ready. Excellent. Those are my dear students, always willing to learn. Good evening, teacher. Hello, Laura. How are you? Good. Excellent. You? Well, um, tired, but... Okay. Tired, but happy. Ah, okay. <laughs> no worry, we happy. <laughs> yeah, no way we're happy. Okay, let's start. Good evening, everyone. Hello. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Okay, let me share my screen. Okay, I guess you can see my screen, right? All right. So let's let's uh let's have another question. Just to warm up the class. Okay, that pap pegar un calentoncito aquí, okay? What do you have for lunch? <laughs> Soup, um, soup, meat, meat, chicken, rice, meat, chicken, uh, rice, and salad. Ah, oh, it's a big lunch. <laughs> Excellent. Soup, chicken, rice, and salad. Wow. Do you know how to say? Gallina India. Oh, delicious. <laughs> no, do you know how to say it? Do you, know, do, you know, do you know how to say that in English? Um. <laughs> Creole. No, Creole, Creole chicken soup. Okay. <clears throat> Real chicken soup. Okay, so what else? Someone else? What What do you have for lunch? My lunch teacher is fish, uh, rice, salem, soda, uh, tortillas. <laughs> tortillas, uh -huh. tortillas, tortillas. Okay, good, excellent. Okay. Let's start today. We're going to study adverbs of frequency. What are the what do the adverbs adverbs of frequencies do? They say they tell how often we do the things. Okay, ¿Qué es lo que hacen los adverbios de frecuencia? Ellos dicen con qué frecuencia hacemos nosotros las cosas. Okay. So here we have the most common 
a adverse of frequency. Of course, we there are more. I I I mucho. I a master. Okay, so we have here. I always eat breakfast. I usually eat breakfast. I often eat breakfast. I sometimes eat breakfast. I hardly ever eat breakfast. I never eat breakfast. Okay, what happened here with sometimes? Sometimes is used both ways. Sometimes can go, can go before the subject or after the subject and uh, between the subject and the verb. Okay, así que tenemos que sometimes es la excepción. Puede ir después del sujeto o entre el sujeto y el verbo. O puede ir antes del de sujeto y es correcto. Pero solamente en conversación. Ok. Understand. Ahora, let's see. Do you understand the adverse of frequency? What does always mean in Spanish? Siempre. Siempre. Usually. Usualmente. Usualmente. Often. Que tan seguido. A menudo. A menudo, con frecuencia. Sometimes. A veces. A veces. A veces. Hardly ever. Eh, Difícilmente. Casi nunca. De vez en cuando. Casi nunca. <risa> casi nunca. Casi nunca. Casi nunca. And never. Nunca. 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 Ah, nunca. No es nunca mente. No. <risa> Okay, nunca, okay. All right, good. Okay. Now I want you to write a sentence using an adverb frequency. Okay, escríbame una con algo que usted, algo personal. Como por ejemplo, I never take a shower. Porque no se baña. <laughs> En la cáscara mantiene el árbol. <laughs> ok, escríbame por favor. Write a, write a sentence and in the chat, please. Using one of these uh, adverbs. En este momento le digo, don't worry, be happy, ¿ok? We are studying okay. the, the, the adverse of frequency, ¿ok? Los adverbios de frecuencia. Ya explicamos el grado que tienen, ¿verdad? Con qué frecuencia, se, qué es lo que quieren decir. Ok, ahora... He pedido que me escriban un, una oración de manera personal y me la manden al chat. Um, bye. All right, thank you. Okay, Victor says, I always use earphones when I, when I receive English class, my English class. 
I sometimes go to the gym. Cabina. Excellent. I always, <laughs> Oscar, I always take a shower and I read the newspaper. ¿Cómo era eso? No, that's a joke. I usually read the newspaper. Excellent. Yes. Flor de María, ¿dónde está la suya? Que me dice si está bien no la veo. Ah, I always have my breakfast. Excellent. Good. Así está bien. Sí, está bien. Ah, ok. Sí, por supuesto que yes. I often do exercise. I always take a shower. Very good, Olivia. I always work in the morning. Mm -hmm, excellent. I often drink coffee in the morning. Laura is a coffee holic. Una adicta al café, coffee holic. Wow, Wendy, what happened? You are a bad tempered person. I often get angry. Mm -mm, that's not good. No, pero de vez en cuando me enojan. Ah, uh -huh. relax. Relax. <laughs> Como el mango relajado, ¿ok? Relax. Relax. Bueno, no, todo... porque soy un pan de Dios. Ah, me, me imagino, así se escucha. Ok, de todos modos es un ejemplo, ¿ok? Anyway is an example. The teacher never... <laughs> ok, María. Ahí se va a estar, María. <laughs> The teacher never bathed. Usted dijo. <risas> ah, ok. El pez por su propia boca muera. Dice. I'm here again. Teach. Ok, Juan. Write an example using another frequency. Ok, teacher. All right. I'm waiting, I'm waiting. ¿Qué pasó con los demás? What happened? I have 19 students. Al menos espero 15 ejemplos. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Eight. Seven more. I have 20 students right now. I always drink coffee in the morning and break. Okay, arreglemos. I always, I always have breakfast and coffee in the morning, okay? I always have breakfast and coffee in the morning. And sweet bread. Semita tres pechadas. Coffee with pepper shot, teacher. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Pero de las tostaditas. Ya, yeah. hechas en, en, en horno artesanal. Por aquí tenemos la dicha que hay una señora que así las hace. Ok. 
Okay, no more examples. Let's continue. Ahí está. Vamos a ver. I always take a bath with... Oh, wow. Okay, tiene la dicha. Hillary. It's good. It's relaxing. That's relaxing. Yes, teacher. It's relaxing. Yeah, pretty relaxing. Sometimes when we are stressed, it's good to take a a, a hot water. I mean, a, a hot a hot bath. Yeah, with a sponge or a towel, like a massage. Okay, let's continue. I'm going to stop here. And I'm going to share another document with you. Okay, let's read this. Uh, this uh, questions. And we have this question says, what do you often do when you are in English class? Understand the question? Yes, teacher. Okay, answer it. Write it in the chat. What are the different activities that you do in the English class? Eh, ¿Le ponemos solo la respuesta o con todo y pregunta? Oh, no, no, only the, only the answer. Only the answer. Let me see. I often participate with my class classmates in the English class. Okay, thank you. But what? Okay, okay. Let's leave it like that. The, the, the answer is, well, I mean, well order. Grammatically, it's okay. Come on, hurry up, hurry up.
Okay, hurry up, please. Oh, you have problem with your internet. Well, Juan, I always listen to the instructions from my teacher and try to learn more words and pronounce them. Excellent, excellent answer, Juan. Thank you, teacher. Here we have the, the, the others. I have 23 students and only two had answer. Solo dos de 23. Not possible. Okay, so much time. Let me see. I sometimes eat eggs, beans, and cheese. No, I don't know. That's no, that's no. I not watch, no, okay, no, 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 no. René Gustavo, esa de, ahí no, 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 eso no es lo que pido, pero en la segunda sí está bien, that this is the correct, end, a, a correct sentence. I always check my email, that is correct. I usually take my dinner or, or only listen. And, ah, ya están cayendo. Sorry, sorry. I participate in the activities. Ah, pero esa era la primera. Ya, ya es la primera. Hay sometimes in air, green, cheese, no? esa es la, la primera. Ok, I usually take my dinner, only listen to my teacher and take notes. Two terror, three I breakfast. Egg beans and coffee for always tired. Uh, no sé qué quiere decir ahí. I never drink coffee. I don't like it. Pero esa es la otra. Yeah, ahí estamos preguntando. What do you often do when you are in, in, in English class? Pero como que hay. O vinieron tarde los mensajes. Porque me están enviando de la primera pregunta y yo ya estamos en la segunda pregunta. Creo que es eso está lento. Eso es lo que pasa. It's not your fault. It's internet fault. Ok, let's continue. Más adelante vamos a hacer más preguntas. Ok, eh, let's share again the... Uh, here, where are we? Here. Okay, let's continue. Okay, address of frequency. Always, usually, often, sometimes, hardly ever, and never. And here, on the next slide, we have an exercise. We have exercise A. On exercise A, you are going to put the adverbs in the correct places. Then practice with a company real. Okay. What happened with the, with the adverbs 
en qué lugar van, en what place in the, in the sentence. Others usually go between the subject and the verb. Okay, esa es la definición. Adverb usually go between the subject and the verb. Van entre el sujeto y el verbo. Ejemplo, what do you usually have for breakfast? Mire, you es el subject. Vamos a hacer un poquito más grande. Here, ahora sí. Can you see it? Ahora sí. Hello. Yes, it's true. Oh, yeah, it's better, teacher. Thank you, it's better, yes, better, teacher. right? Okay, mire, mire la posición. After the subject and before the verb. Aquí va, mire, ahí está la flechita. Okay, what are you going to do is place the adverb in the correct, I mean, in the correct place. Ahora tiene often, ever, sometimes, usually, and never. Okay, hágalo, por favor. Let's do it. I usually watch all kind of movies. Y al chat se las mandamos también a estas fichas. Solo léanmela, por favor.
¿Cómo se pronuncia de la última que está escrito Hardly? Hardly ever. Hardly ever. Ever. Hardly ever. Bueno, yo creo que van así. Eh, la primera. Well, uh, I often have coffee, cereal, and juice. Uh -huh. Yes, yes. Two. Do you ever eat breakfast at work? Okay. I sometimes have breakfast at my dress. Okay. Uh, and no, I hardly ever have rice. I hardly ever. Hardly ever, for that. Hardly, hardly. Okay. Uh, so, uh -huh. Okay. Have rice. Uh -huh. Okay, thank you. Good answers. Thank you. Okay, let's check. Uh, okay, what do you usually have for breakfast? Well, I often have coffee, cereal, and juice. Do you, do you ever eat breakfast at work? I sometimes have breakfast at my desk. Do you usually eat rice for breakfast? No, I hardly ever have rice. Okay, then you say, well, I often have coffee. Okay, muy bien, ahí estamos. These are in the chat, yes. Oh, creo que aquí está la cuestión, ¿por qué me están contestando? En el listado de preguntas hay 16 preguntas. Yo solo hice la primera. Por eso es que me están contestando, what kinds of movies? Y también, what do you sometimes eat for breakfast? Pongan atención, ok, está bien, ¿verdad? Pero pongan atención, yo solo hice la primera, únicamente, por eso estaban tardando en responder. Sí, porque yo le puse como tres. No, es que solo la, yo, sola, yo solamente hice la primera. Las demás las vamos a ir ahí a... a eh, Abarcar el transcurso poco, de la clase. Correcto. O ah. mañana y así, pues, ¿verdad? Porque ah, son, de, son demasiadas. No, no es, <ríe> y yo tratando de apurarme. Con 10, no, <ríe> solo una y se Ok, pero, ok, ya arreglamos esa situación. Ok, so here, I need another, another volunteer who wants to read this, uh, this conversation. Nadie lo vale, okay. Eh, uh, no sé si yo lo he hecho bien. Okay, dale. Si quiere, dale. Okay, continue, please. Well, I often have coffee, cereal, and juice. Okay. Do, do you ever eat breakfast at work? Uh-huh. I have some time breakfast at my desk. Or sería I sometimes have. No, I, I sometimes have. 
I sometimes have breakfast at my desk. Do you usually eat rice for breakfast? Uh -huh. No, I hardly ever have rice. Rice. Okay. Right. Okay, thank you. Very good. Okay, let's continue with another activity. Okay, aquí tenemos one and scramble the sentences. So the, the sentences are in disorder. You are going to order these questions, okay? What question? This question. <coughs> Yo ya las tengo contestadas. Oh, pero okay. No sé. Mándelas. Se las. In the chat. Okay. Man... In the chat. No, se... Okay. Electricity. Okay. I don't okay. Now I want a volunteer who can read because I see everybody has the the right order. 
Okay, number two. Veamos aquí que la pedimos. Wendy, read number two. Word. Ah, perdón. Y que le estoy leyendo donde no está. I hardly ever eat a snack at work. Okay, thank you. Very good. Laura, number three. Okay. Number three. Number three. Uh, I often have dinner with, with my family. That is number four. But okay, that's it. Yeah, yeah. Okay, four. You you re, you wrote four. Oh, okay. I see, make you okay. <laughs> okay, don't worry, but it's okay. Flor de Maria, number three. Okay. And I sometimes eat pasta for dinner. All right. Okay. Next. Rewrite the sentences from part B with your own information. Then compare with a part. Aquí la vamos a ocupar entre todos, ¿ok? ¿Cuáles son las preguntas de sentences? From part, part B, dice. It's this one. O sea, la va a personalizar. Okay, this one, number one, two, three, uh, only three, only three sentences. I, it says Olivia, I hardly ever have, aquí faltó, I hardly ever have, or no, eat. I, har I hardly ever eat snacks at work. I sometimes eat pasta for dinner. I often have dinner with my family. Excellent. Okay, I'm going to ask you to read. I hardly ever eat snack at work. I hardly ever. Uh, I usually eat a snack at work. Quitalo. No lo usé. No me funcionó. Sí, cambiando. Esa es la tuya. Ok. I sometimes eat pasta with my friends. Ok.
I often have dinner. So entonces I always have I always, I often have pizza for dinner with my family. Often have pizza for dinner with my family. Okay. Thank you. I sometimes eat meat with my mom. I often have dinner with my sister and my brother in law. Okay, let's work on the next exercise, my friends. This is the, uh, maybe not the last exercise, but the previous one. Okay, we have another answer. Let's check the last answer. I hardly ever play basketball with my son. I sometimes go to my son's Taekwondo class. Oh, wow. Taekwondo, martial arts are, are amazing. Excellent. Okay, my friends, we're gonna work on these uh, questions. Aquí dice, add three questions about mealtime habits to the chart. Pero lo vamos a dejar así, I guess six questions are enough. Suficientes preguntas. Porque aún no nos hemos reunido. The rooms, okay. Okay, I'm going to explain the activity. ¿Cómo va esta actividad? Bueno, en grupo van a hacer esto. Mire, alguien va a preguntar, do you usually eat breakfast? No, I hardly ever do. Hay personas que dicen, I skip breakfast. O I, o I skip uh, dinner. O sea, que se saltan ese, ese tiempo de comida, ¿ok? O, por ejemplo, what time do you usually eat lunch? Me tiene que responder con la hora. ¿Ok? Do you ever eat meat for dinner? Ahí ustedes eligen. Breakfast, lunch, or dinner. ¿Understand the activity? Yes, teacher. Ok, let's go to the rooms. Right. Piche. Hello. No me pareció para unirme. Let me see, Jensi. Sí. Vamos a ver, Jensi. Aquí está, dice que no se unió. Y hay una carita con una lengua de fuera. Mira, ahí como que nos está haciendo muecas usted. Mire, qué mala. No, si yo estaba esperando. 
Ahorita la manda otro. <risa> estoy molestando, estoy molestando. A ver si, la, si, si se puede unir al, al, al Room 5. No. Pues aquí le voy a preguntar. Ok. A ver. Ahorita. Ahorita, ahorita. Ok, Jensi. Do you usually eat lunch? Uh, um, uh, I... <laughs> I... Yes, I, y luego el, 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 ad, el adverbio. Yes, I, I lunch. No, y el adverbio. Ya me perdí. Yes, I always. Oh, oh, oh. Sí, vamos a ver tu es que usted ya me puso nerviosa. Oh, come on, come on. Así de... Relax. En cambio, en el grupo todo está ahí. Este, Ay, yo, yo la, de, debería de ser diferente. Debería ser como. Tiene más apoyo conmigo. Ok, entonces este, ayúdeme. Por eso le voy a decir así, va. hágame usted la pregunta. Do you usually, esa va. Ajá. Uno. Yes. Do you usually eat? ¿Qué? Breakfast, lunch or dinner? Um, eh, breakfast. Breakfast. Mm -hmm. Yes, I always have a big breakfast. Okay. Yes, I, I have. I always have a big breakfast. Usualmente. I always. Yo digo I always. No necesariamente voy a usar este adverbio que está aquí. Ah, ok. Pero voy a hacerlo personal. Si usted, okay. si usted observa en el ejemplo... Aquí le, di, le dijeron aquí, aquí Yoshi, do you usually eat breakfast? Y él respondió con esto. No, I hardly ever do. Ok. Eso es personal. Es como la a segunda. Ver. Le voy a hacer la segunda. What time do you usually eat lunch? I lunch? No, eso no lo no puede I... decir. I have, I usually always, or, okay, or I often, pero no me acuerdo, no, eh, que eso, pues si usted dice, I lunch, es como que estuviera hablando en español. Okay. ¿Verdad? ¿Verdad que sí? Uh -huh, Yo almuerzo, sí. no, no es así, en inglés no es así. I always, I, I usually, I usually have lunch. Okay. I usually uh -huh. have lunch. Have lunch at. Y luego va la hora. At. Have lunch. Eat. Uh, eat. Eat three o'clock. At three. At three p.m. Okay. Do you ever eat meat for lunch? Yo, uh, it's a, a nunca. 
No, que si algún, que si eh, come carne en el almuerzo. Ay, eh, ay, I always, I always have. O, yo, o puede decir, I always do. Para no hacerlo tan largo. Ajá. Ya me okay. está respondiendo que sí, ¿verdad? Okay. Sí. Hágame la cuatro usted. Eh, do you ever go to the restaurant? No, ahí no dice to the restaurant. For? Ahí dice to a restaurant. Do you ever Ajá. go to, to a restaurant? Ajá. For? For? Eh, ah, que yo se la conteste. No, yo, usted me yo la, la está haciendo. Usted me ah. la está haciendo. Espérenme. Es que al final de las preguntas va a agregar breakfast, lunch, or dinner. Ah, ok. Cualquiera Pero de es, esas. En Entonces, serio, con usted me he trabado toda. Oh. Do you ever go to a restaurant for? Breakfast. Breakfast. Mm, I hardly ever do. I hardly ever do. Okay. Okay. We're finished. Vamos a llamar a los chicos que ya va llegando la hora. Chimenguencho. Teacher. Hello. Tengo una. I have a question. Yeah, tell me. Um. And three, three questions. Se podría decir, eh, eh, I always eat sí. meat. Ya. Yeah, eh, eat meat. Ajá. Uh -huh. O oh, puede decir, yes, I always do. Ah, oh, ok. Thanks. Okay. ok, we're going to continue with the... Uh, We're going to continue with the adverb frequency tomorrow, okay? Okay. I'm going to pass the list. Alejandra Maria. Okay, yo lo Present, teacher. Thank you. Hillary. Hillary. Hillary Clinton. Here, I'm here, I'm here. Thank you, thank you. Andrea Susana. No. Me avisan si escribe el chat. Brenda. No está. Brenda. Okay. Goodbye. Daniel. Tell me. Tell me. Present teacher. Thank you. Lord de Maria. Si me estuvo molestando. Yo no. Present teacher. <laughs> Esmeralda. No es mi culpa que no se vaya. Ah, mentira. <risa> se va el agua. Se va el agua seguido. Ok. ¿Esmeralda? No está tampoco. ¿Glenda? Present. Thank you. Jacqueline? Present. Jefferson? Uh, present teacher. Thank you. Jennifer Selina. Here teacher. Thank you. Jennifer Arevalo.
Okay. Jenny. Present teacher. Thank you. Jose Ignacio. Present teacher. Juan Antonio. Present teacher. Karina. Karina. No responde. Por el chat le está diciendo presente, teacher. Ah, ok. Gracias, gracias. Gracias por la ayuda. Kevin Rodríguez. Present. Kevin Colosho. Present. Thank you. Laura. Present, teacher. Luis Alejandro. Present, teacher. Thank you. Present. Olivia. Present. Oscar. I'm here. Rene. Present. Thank you, Victor. Present. Wendy Marisol. Aquí, teacher. Jensi, acabamos de estar conversando. Excelente. Zulma. Zulma. No, don't worry. Be happy. Zulma. No está Zulma. Ok. Ah, no está. Ok, my friends. We're finished. So, see you tomorrow. Tengo que irme. Oh, I, I, bye. I, I, bye. I see you tomorrow. Go. See you tomorrow, tomorrow.